The situation in Yemen is looking quite grave at the moment, and a lot of Chinese people have come back from the country. When do you see a political process will take place to help resolve the issue, and what can China do to facilitate the process? Well, the Yemen situation is very critical, and、uh, we follow it very closely.、Uh, we now are in a stage of military action,、uh, and、uh, what we have to deal with is.、Uh, Problems of right now evacuation.、Uh, we are grateful for、uh, China's help with the evacuation,、uh, but we also have a growing、uh, humanitarian problem.、Uh, and、uh, if this development continues, we may have a very serious、uh, situation to deal with, both from a humanitarian and political perspective.、Uh, I know the Security Council、uh, of the United Nations is working on this, and I'm sure China. Will bring、uh, constructive ideas to that debate, but it is desirable at some stage, at some stage, to、uh, introduce an element of a political process, because、uh, all conflicts in the end have to、uh, finish by a、uh, type of sharing of interests and、uh, finding a negotiated solution. So I would hope that we would move in the direction of diplomacy. This year marks the 70th anniversary of the founding of the United Nations, and at the same time, there are a lot of、uh, discussions about the reform of the Security Council. Tell us more about that. Well, this is、uh, an issue for the member states. They are debating this right now in the General Assembly, and、uh, I must admit that there is a certain impatience、uh, among member states about the Security Council, and the reason for this, in my view. Is very much the fact that the Security Council has not provided a strong resolution on Syria. The Syria situation, with all its tragic consequences politically,、uh, in terms of refugees and,、uh, and human suffering and spreading of the conflict to Iraq and possibly other neighboring countries, all this has led to a frustration and a, a、uh, disappointment in the.、Uh, Uh, in the working of the Security Council, I would hope that this year, when the conflict has existed for four years, and when we now approach, approach soon the three-year anniversary of Kofi Annan's peace proposals, 2012, 2012, that we should find a solution. And I've spent much time of my discussions today with the State Councillor and the two Deputy Foreign Ministers in discussing. Whether we could give new energy to the political efforts.